Hey, it's been a while since you've seen my little happy smiling face. Yeah, I know. Uh, we're going to do a little bit of makeup, a little bit of, I don't know, um, kind of a different declutter maybe. Um, I've got some stuff that I've never tried or really tried. Um, so that's what we're going to do. And using the Urban Decay, I think this is the anti-aging. I can't see it well enough to the eyeshadow primer and we're using it underneath and above because I don't know it just seems I keep trying to find something to make me look 20 again <laughs> it is planting season in Kentucky actually it's past planting season for a lot of things I'm a little bit behind it, the fingernails look over. It's number one. It's planting season. Number two. I dyed my hair. And I used the Ion brand from Sally's. And didn't think about it possibly having more staying power than what I usually use. Um, and I tend to... I tend to at least take one glove off because I, that way I can make sure it gets all through my hair. And well, yeah, it got all through my hair. It really, really did. So, let's see. Trying to make sure that I have everything so that I don't have to move around as much as I normally do. And to be real honest with you, I'm still going to have to get stuff out of this cabinet. I need dropping hair dye brushes. I need powder. Um, trying to do, I've been decluttering, as you know, for quite some time. I keep, um, keep getting rid of stuff. And there's still stuff. Um, so when you really know that you have way too much stuff. I'm just going to take a little of the Urban Decay. Hold on, I'll finish showing you what it is. I don't normally do this. But I'm going to give it a shot just to see what happens. Because why not? It is the Urban Decay... all-nighter translucent um, setting powder but I'm gonna just I'm gonna just see what happens whenever we set this primer on my eyeshadow I'm sorry on my eyelid geez can we say we've just forgotten how to do this It, it's just a translucent powder. They do make, and it's my favorite thing, they do make a powder that is, um, makes your makeup waterproof. I'm going to use, this is the Mauve's by Juvia's Place. This is about the product, if I like it. Nothing about the, com the company, nothing about the drama. Nothing about anything like that. I just ain't, I just ain't up for it. Yes, I know my face has a lot of redness. Tell you, explain why. If you hear stuff in the background, little man's watching Peppa Pig or something to that effect. He's finished school, so he gets to have fun till we got karate this afternoon or martial arts. I don't know why I keep calling it karate. 
Um, but anyway, I'm going to take this color. And part of what this is going to be is I've noticed that I'm having trouble letting go of some things and I've noticed that one of the reasons is because I either haven't tried it, I spent a lot of money on it, um, I've got a palette that I absolutely don't like. I mean, absolutely. Every Lots of people rave about it and love it. I don't like it at all. I mean, I don't, it's just not, um, and I keep telling myself I'm going to try it one more time before I, you know, give it up because I paid a lot of money for it. It's a Natasha Denona palette, and it's actually, um, I think the retro. It's actually one that should be really simple to work with, but for me it's not. Hold on, I'll get it. No, it's the glam palette, not the retro. Um, I, I just don't. For whatever reason, me and it don't like each other. So, um, that's just kind of how that is. Uh, going to go into this little cup, this pink. I don't see any names. Um, so we're just going to put a little makeup on and try not to take all day doing it. You know, while I'm doing this, Whenever I started doing videos so many years ago, I had a plan. I had a reason why I was sharing my life and coming on to YouTube. Actually, I started on Facebook doing Facebook Lives. And It was more to just, you know, give you a, a give you a good word, a good message, you know, something something to kind of uplift your day, um, you know, because everybody's struggling with something. We all got something going on, um, and my something is no worse or better than your something. It's just something, okay. Um, deciding I'm gonna go into this one just for a little touch of dimension dementia dimension wow in the corner some of the colors in palettes are deceptive I expected that to be a lot darker Oh, well, not big. Nothing we can't blend out. Um, anyway, I've noticed that, you know, I do hauls. Um, those are mostly just kind of for the fun of it. Um, they're kind of filler videos. Um, easy content, for lack of a better way of putting it. Y'all know that, just as much as I do. Um, look straight on. It's hard to see in this camera. Um, here's the thing, though. Somewhere along the line, I neglect. I stopped talking about what matters the most to me, and just kind of like you know wing wing it on you know we're at my mom's we're here this happened blah 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 and i didn't i lost track of you know 
my my purpose of having a channel, my purpose, my sole purpose of doing all of this. And so kind of have to come back to that just a little bit. Um, because I just see so much, so much stuff that just blows my mind. And people, you got, especially women, man, we got to quit. I don't know how many of us, I'm using the Urban Decay All Nighter Face Primer. Um, this will be about the second time that I've used it. I was not real impressed. Um, this is the Long Wear Foundation Grip. I was not real impressed the first time that I used it. I will tell you. Um, anyway, we have got to do something different, something better. We are, and when I say we, it's a collective. We are busy, 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 tearing each other down so much so that it's ridiculous. Um, and again, this is not directed to anything specific. It's just what's been on my heart. Um, there's so much, and, you know, I've noticed it in conversations with people. Sometimes you're talking to somebody and they're saying the same exact thing that you're saying, but they're not getting what you're saying. And it's like, how does this work? Going with some, it's Smashbox. Becca, I forgot about this until just recently, and I love this stuff. Um, color corrector for under my eyeballs. I did all my skincare earlier today. So, you know, we're just basically doing a little bit of a look. But, you know, I, I did a video... And, and I was, I, it, it crossed, it got on my mind a while ago because I was in the kitchen planting little weeds because, you know, like I said, it is that time of year. Um, you know, it's garden time. It's time to get all that prep done, things that, you know, I uh, try to grow as much from seed as possible because it's really expensive to, to buy seedlings. Um, and when you buy seedlings, you're kind of taking away, you know, the, the value of, you know, behind growing your own food, so to speak. Um, you have more control over it and all that neato stuff. But I was thinking about, you know, I've been watching all the, a lot of stuff transpire. Um, and I've been, just blending this out a little bit because it needs it bad. Um, I, ha I noticed before Cinda died, something major that I really, really, really caught myself doing. I say things and I think they're funny. So that's why I say them. And I say them picking on myself. Um, and I don't mean anything by it. But not everybody knows that. Pretty much like it is. I think I'm going to take a little bit. And I noticed, just going into this purple, and just kind of sweeping it over my eyelid a little bit. These colors are really kind of meh. Um, um, 
but they noticed one night I was going over the gate. We, towards the end of um, Cinda's life, she kind of would just kind of wander aimlessly throughout the night. And it happens with dogs. It happens with people. It happens, okay? Um, but what she would just kind of, she would get up and she would go to my daughter's door and bark. Or she'd go to the basement door and bark. And sometimes she needed to let out. Most of the time, she was just waking everybody up. Well, so we got to where we moved the gate just outside my door so that she couldn't, you know, she couldn't get any further than that so that if she was waking up anybody, it was most likely me. And I'm using the Tarte Anti-Aging Putty Primer. And I love this stuff. I know they say that the Tarte Primer is similar to this. Not as far as I can tell. And I just kind of got a little carried away on that side. So let me kind of blend that in a little bit. But anyway, what, I was, what came to my mind is, you know, when we when when we are growing something, as long as you keep it, you know, fed and watered, whether it's a person, a plant, or whatever, as long as you keep putting good stuff into it, it's going to grow. You know, nutrition or you know, nutrients, water, stuff like that. It's going to grow and it's going to continue to grow. Well. Um, my point when I, I was coming over the gate one night and I always said silly stuff and one night I said I'm going to fool around and, and break my hip or something like that something crazy coming over the gate you know just crazy um, being silly just because why not well, a little later, I hear my boy say the same thing. And it's like, oh, my, that's not good. Um, and it's not because he did not, he didn't understand that what I was saying, I was saying it to be funny. He's repeating my words, not to be funny, really thinking that I could hurt myself or he could hurt himself. So my point of everything is we got to stop watering. I've talked about this before, but it's been a while. We got to stop watering our dead plants. And what I mean by that is we have to stop speaking negative into ourselves, over ourselves, about other people, all that stuff. Because whether it be true or not, when you invite that negativ negativity into your headspace, it affects you, whether you intend for it to or not, or whether you intend for it to affect the other person, it still affects you. And it affects, when it affects you, it affects everybody around you. So we have to just stop watering dead plants. And I mean, it just, I, some things just, I, I just kind of, I see it and I kind of go, maybe I was raised different I don't know um, or maybe because I tend to stay to myself I don't know there's just some things that I just kind of go I don't understand and you know some of it too is dealing with my own personal issues and you know hearing things be said over the years you know we have a, a generation of children namely females that are growing up extremely depressed, dangerously depressed, suicidal depressed at very young ages. So keeping that in mind, I have to wonder, is, is it not worth watching what we say, paying more attention to our words, speaking a little bit more kindly about ourselves, about other people? I mean, 
surely I'm not the only one that feels this way. Um, literally, a generation of girls. The study came out, I can't remember, a couple of days ago. Young girls who are not even, you know, not even hitting puberty before they're hitting depression and being suicidal. put on to mix my foundation a little bit um and talk to Ian he came through with the computer going I was like get here little dude um but what I was saying is we have a generation of you may come and say hi uh, hold you'll on. have to get this stool be very careful it's in the kitchen by the greenhouse we have a generation of girls, and I'm, I, I just, I seen, barely, I seen the study was girls. I'm sure that there are boys that are affected too. Um, who are dealing with things that they shouldn't even have to be dealing with. Here I am. Say hi, little dude. Hi, fans. Um, I'm creating a box car and I mean by a box car I'm creating it with boxes and I'm drawing on it with a black crayon I've got the car done now I'm making an attachment for the bed like let me show you by the way behind me is his D or martial arts Be careful, don't knock your knee down. Come on. This is the progress, which Please is Please don't knock my coffee over. Which is the rear lights. Okay. Because, because the box will just cover up the main car's lights. So that's why I put lights on the back of there. Okay, are you finished? So I can finish this up, please. And one more little thing. If you want to make a box car, you can use one box and you need a black crayon, or actually a crayon of any color, a marker, or you can use a Sharpie. So basically, you just draw what you want on the car. Okay, I'm going to go. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Okay. I had a feeling he would, that's, that's what he came through here for, was to see what I was doing. He heard me talking and, yeah, so we'll let him have a few minutes. And while we were doing that, I just put my foundation on and it's the same, or, um, not Urban Decay, it's Estee Lauder, uh, double wear, I use the sheer, and I use my tried and true because it works. Um, but anyway, okay, her tape, have to see what he's taping. Um, anyway, just my thought for today. Well, we're doing a little bit of makeup. I've got to get ready to take him to karate. To martial arts. I don't know why I say that every time. Um, but uh, we got to try to do better in how we speak to other people. Everybody's going through something. Don't add to their something. Please don't add to their something. Lift them up, if anything. Um, There's a lot of people going through a lot, you know, life, there's a lot of people struggling financially, all kinds of stuff. So, you know, let's just try to be a little kinder to it and, and to ourselves especially. And let's not water those dead plants. Anyway, this is kind of where this is going to end because it's already, time has gotten away from me and I need to answer a phone call. But anyway, this is from... The Moths by Juvia's Place. Um, do I like this palette? 
currently not so much. Well, I'll play with it a little bit more and let you know how I feel about it. For now, don't water dead plants. Don't speak negative things. Just try not to do it. Not over yourself, not over somebody else. And you know, I don't know. Um, a lot of things that when it comes out of your mouth, it comes, it, you're, you're speaking it into you as well as whoever else you're speaking it to. So try to say good things. Try to be uplifting. Try to be nice. Try to be positive. Um, That's right. Because you never know, you never know whose life may depend on your next word. I mean, literally, in this day and age, literally, somebody's life could depend on your next word. Anyway, I'm going to finish putting my makeup on. That was just all that was on my heart. Y'all have a good day. Remember, I am the mayor's daughter. And back here who is making the box is the mayor's great-grandson. We'll see you in the next video. May declutter this. See you, bye.